Hey guys, my name is Sarah. I've lived in my Airstream for six months now, and today I'm gonna give you a list of 12 of my favorite items for RV living. Now that I've lived in a travel trailer for six months, I've been able to test out a lot of products and decide which ones are my favorite for RV living. I've already made a video on all of the essential items that you need to purchase when buying a travel trailer or an RV, so I will link that one above. This video is guided more towards products that aren't absolutely essential, but they make RV living easier, safer, and more enjoyable. If you guys are interested in any of the products I talk about in this video, make sure you check the description below. I'm gonna put links to everything and there's also going to be a bunch of discount codes for you guys as well. I'm gonna start with all of my favorite accessories outside of the trailer and then we'll work our way inside. One item that is so simple yet so useful that I've had pretty much since day one on my trailer is this motion sensor light. Motion sensor lights are great for safety and security, not only from humans, but from bears as well. This thing is battery operated and I haven't had to change the batteries out once in the six months that I've had this light. I mounted it with a strong adhesive double-sided tape and didn't have to use any screws. It's also super easily removed when traveling. Another item that I love having for safety and security on the outside of my trailer is a wireless doorbell camera. This thing will notify me anytime it detects human activity outside of my trailer. When I lived in an RV park, it was amazing because I could see when my dog walker was coming by and when someone knocked on my door in the middle of the day while I was trying to sleep after an overnight shift, I was able to just hop on my phone and see who it was before I decided to get out of bed. It's also super easy to take off when you're traveling. The only downside to this doorbell camera in particular is it's not fully wireless. There's a unit that needs to be plugged into your trailer at all times and it also needs to be plugged into a Wi-Fi source. This isn't a problem for me currently because I have an electric hookup and I also have a hotspot device that I can plug it into. Another item on the outside of my trailer that's made my life so much easier is my RV snap pads. These are permanent jack pads. They're super easy to install. All I had to do was lower the jack onto the pad and it just snaps right in place. Not only do these save me time and energy when I'm setting up and breaking down camp, but they also save me a little bit of storage room because I don't have to store jack pads in my tiny little outdoor storage compartment anymore. So I tow my Airstream with a Jeep Grand Cherokee. My trailer's weight is just below 80% of my towing capacity, so I invested in a very unique hitch. This weight distribution hitch is by Waysafe, and I love it because it has a scale on it that shows you what your current tongue weight is once you're hitched up. If my tongue weight is ever above what it should be, I can actually adjust it right here. They provide this tool, but if you don't feel like hand cranking it, you can buy a bit that goes onto your drill or you can use a torque wrench as well. This hitch is a bit pricier than others, but I love having that peace of mind, knowing that I'm towing safely. Okay, moving on to the inside. Just as I walk in the door, I have a camera mounted right on the wall. This gives me a clear view of my entire trailer at all times. It does have to be connected to Wi-Fi, so I keep it connected to my hotspot device and that allows me to go onto the app and view the live feed at any time. And it also notifies me of any sort of motion detection. So I can see if anyone breaks into my trailer. I use this to keep an eye on my dog and make sure she is safe and behaving while I'm gone. I love that it is rechargeable. The battery lasts for about two weeks and it's super easy to take off of the wall and put back on. I didn't install it with any sort of screws. I just used a strong double-sided tape. I don't take it off the wall when I'm towing my trailer and it has never fallen. Another item I keep in my trailer to make sure that my dog is safe while I'm gone is a Waggle pet monitor. 
Not only does this tell me the temperature of my trailer at all times, it also has GPS tracking on it. So if anyone were to steal my trailer, I would know exactly where it is. This is also rechargeable and you have to charge it about once a week, but it's well worth it to have that peace of mind to know that my dog isn't overheating in my trailer. The app will notify you if the temperature goes outside of the limits that you set. So if your power were to go out while you're gone and your air conditioning stops working, you're gonna be the first to know because this is going to notify you via text message. Another item I really love having in my trailer is my Jackery power station. It is 300 watts and it is more capable than you'd think. I can charge just about anything on this and it's extremely useful when I don't want to run my inverter while boondocking. Especially on a cold night, I get to plug in my electric blanket and it's so toasty and warm. I primarily use this for the 12 volt connection. It really comes in handy when my tire pressure is low and I need to use my air compressor and the cord won't reach to my car. So I mainly use it to inflate my Airstream tires but it can also be used for a wide variety of things. It can be charged with a regular wall outlet, which I have one in my car and I just charge it while I'm driving, or you can get the solar panel package and charge it that way. My favorite RV friendly gadget for my kitchen, which I have mentioned in other videos before, is my rechargeable blender. I love that I don't have to plug this in when boondocking, one charge lasts for almost a week when I blend once a day. It's actually pretty impressive for a battery operated blender. And I love how small and compact it is. It's very RV friendly if you don't have much storage. So my Airstream came with a TV mounted to this wall. Call me crazy, but I removed it. I honestly don't watch that much TV. It opened up so much counter space and it decluttered my kitchen tremendously. On the rare occasion that I would like to watch some TV, I got this little projector and it is a great replacement for my physical TV. The size of it is small and compact, making it very RV friendly and it's extremely versatile. I can project on the curtains by my bed, the door to my bathroom, the shade in front of my dinette window, like I said, it's a great replacement for having a physical TV, or you could just get it to watch movies outside as well. I totally can't stand fully on my bed, so I'm doing this like lunge right now. Another awesome little gadget that I love having in my Airstream is this rechargeable fan. You can mount it pretty much anywhere because it's just an adhesive nail. As long as it's on a flat surface, you're fine. This has three different speeds, it oscillates, you can angle it up to go out to the living room or I can angle it down to go to my bed. And like I said, it's rechargeable. So it's great for boondocking and dry camping because you don't have to plug it into a regular wall outlet. Another extremely beneficial item for my trailer has been a small electric heater. I have this one by Lasco. The size of it is perfect because I can keep it underneath my dinette table when I'm not using it, or I can store it right in between the two bins underneath my bed and it fits perfectly. It does have to be plugged into a wall outlet, but it works super well and it's great if you have an electric hookup. It heats my trailer up within minutes. This item is not 100% essential because you can run your furnace, but this baby is gonna save you so much propane, it's ridiculous. If you're winter camping and the temperature drops below freezing, you still wanna run your furnace just to prevent your holding tanks from freezing. Last but certainly not least is my Dyson vacuum. I've had this thing for years, way before I got the Airstream. This is one of those products that I agree is way expensive, but it's so worth the money because this thing is tried and true and it's lasted me forever. This vacuum is perfect for RV life because it breaks down really small and it doesn't have to be plugged in while you're using it. It has all sorts of attachments for any nook and cranny that you can imagine. Traveling with a Siberian Husky in a small space Having a Dyson vacuum has been a lifesaver. All right, so that pretty much wraps things up. I'm sure there's a lot of great RV accessories out there that I didn't mention. Please feel free to comment below with your favorite RV accessories. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. 
Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.